it back up? All right. Global Defense Company Bay Systems revealed the design of a highly agile, armor-protected platform developed under the U.S. Army's Mobile Protected Firepower MPF, program. Bay Systems has released an infographic of the approved version of a new combat vehicle required by the Army to provide the Infantry Brigade Combat Team IV, with a protected platform capable of delivering overwhelming precision firepower combined with the ability to move rapidly in a variety of terrain conditions. According to a released infographic, the new light tank equipped with 105mm cannon, and an auto-loading ammunition system that allows the gun to fire at a rate of 12 rounds per minute. It is also fitted with heavy and medium machine guns. The new combat vehicle leverages investments the Army made in the M8 armored gun system, including its low-profile design, and proven technologies. The innovative rollout power pack design allows for easy access to the engine and transmission without the aid of heavy equipment. It also integrates scalable armor and innovative survivability subsystems to protect the vehicle and crew from threats on the future battlefield. The metal bolt-on armor system provides field repairable, or replacement. The vehicle employs situational awareness systems adding to the highest levels of survivability and crew protection. The compact design allows for multiple vehicle deployment on a C-17 and exceeds the Army's transport requirement and it is sustainable within the UCT. In addition, the U.S. Army has announced that a new light tank for the U.S. infantry hits the next phase of evaluation. According to a statement issued on 11th of December by Ashley John, the first of several pre-production mobile protected firepower, MPF, ground combat platforms are being delivered to Fort Bragg, NC to be used in the soldier vehicle assessment, SVA. Should be a deep well socket.
Staff section cleaner artillery, five each. Alpha 3 4, we have your Allen Key. So this is the wedge they're going to talk about. These are all the different sizes. This is your freaking actual Anderson device itself. It's your eyepiece and this is what it looks out of. Okay? You have your laser in here and they're going to ask you about that cap with this little strap on it. Because everyone gets lost, they're like, what are they talking about? That's what they're talking about. And then they're going to ask, make sure you have two batteries in here and then these four slots right here. Metal, metal rod. Dragon? Thank you.